you know, even before they leave the station, folks. Arms, legs, nose, toes, everything inside the carriage all the way around. Remain seated till I get back into the station. So with that, all aboard. Look at that. He's outside his cabin. Well, this time of the day, you figure he'll be inside making dinner. But, oh, look carefully. I see what he's doing. He's afraid of that skeleton in there. He's in there roasting a hot dog, having a coke. Oh, a very good Thanksgiving meal. Well, there's our bush the moose. Just come out of the lake and far end there, the Blinking Top Trestle, part of the Galloping Goose Lockside Trail today. Old days, that was part of the rail system between Victoria and Sydney. Oh, we got some interesting looking little bears along the side here, and whoa, look at this little family of squirrels. They were enjoying that sunshine earlier. Another little bear, he's already been out to the pumpkin patch, and Oh, here's Grizz. He comes back every year to watch over our pumpkin patch. He's got his little friends there, the beavers. And he brought some more friends over here. Look, he brought Howard. Now, Howard is the world's tallest gnome. Yeah, if you take a look, he's waving at you with that right hand, a little slow and blinking those eyes, but... <laughs> Wow, he looks a lot better than he did when he was standing on the highway just outside in a noose there. I don't know anyone, if anyone's been up that way, but Gailey's brought him down and let David Gray go at it. David's made a beautiful job of refurbishing him. Now, he also watches over our pumpkin patch here. In order to get to our pumpkin patch, you got to bring out one of our hay wagons and hurt, search high and low for that perfect pumpkin. Or, hey, just come on out and use those pumpkins as a great backdrop for family photos. <laughs> and it's also the only spot to hitch a ride on the cow train. But I'm just looking. I think the cow train's on its way back in now. Must have made its last run. Oh, over here on our way. That's Blinkensop Creek. Joins Blinkensop Lake and Swan Lake. Helps with the water quality between the two. Grass. 
What I ran right down through the center of our pocket patch here. Yeah, very much. The Gailies, municipality of Sandwich, and the Ministry of the Environment, they moved it over to the side. With that, they made a great haven for dragonflies. They help keep the bug population down on the farm, as well as the 100,000 ladybugs that the Gailies release every year, and they help with the aphids on the plant. Now, here we are with our berry patch, raspberries, early blueberries, more raspberries. Look up here, they're already getting the uh, berry crop ready for the winter. The new type of raspberry, no longer do you have to tie up the new canes and cut out the dead wood. You just cut the canes right down and they will uh, sprout up again and flower and berry again. Far less intensive work. Now there's the good witch. at the farm. Pumpkins Looks nice. like she's doing a little happy dance, hoping somebody will invite her home for Thanksgiving dinner. Well, then again, maybe she's just getting ready for Halloween. Now on our left here, this is a later variety of blueberries. Got the netting that we have to pull over when the berries ripen because the birds seem to arrive here at the same time. Now directly ahead, we have our Halloween graveyard. Object is to work your way back through the graveyard. But through the corn maze to the graveyard. Not an easy task. <laughs> not too many people in there right now. Hopefully they're not lost in our corn maze. Well, as we enter the big top, we have a family of skeletons on the Ferris wheel. We have another group on the merry-go-round, and oh, look at these little critters that are riding what looks like the inside of a clock. Now, I think sometimes they get inside my watch because it never tells the right time. Oh, we got more skeletons in here, folks. Whoa, and look at the size of that spider. Well, I think we're okay. We're safe. It's far enough away from us. Look at the old guy shivering and shaking here. Not sure whether he's afraid of the spider or just how cold it was this morning. And we have one skeleton in the shower there. Look at that. Just like the good witch, he's hoping someone will invite him home for Thanksgiving dinner. Now as we come out of the big top there, here's our new train on the right-hand side there. We're having a few mechanical problems with it right now, so being the last train, I don't think some people were involved in having their long waits we had, and we do apologize for those, and hope we will get that situation remedied quickly. Now up ahead here, ah, oh, last year, Harkins, we have a pirate ship, and look at that, they have left some of their crew behind on the dock. So someone told me now they're running with just a skeleton crew. <laughs> oh, here we go, the Valley of the Dinosaurs. We have an archaeological dig going on there. T-Rex skeleton, raptors in there. saber took tiger up the hill, stegosaurus, oh, look at that poor little, he was, poor little caveman, he was the one chosen to cook the turkey, I guess. There's his buddies just playing on the rock. Oh, there's Mama T-Rex. Careful, folks. She gets a little possessive over those hatchlings of hers. Now, to our right, Old Town, to access that through our corn maze. And the far end there, that's our haunted house. But all those other buildings have some pretty interesting displays inside. Now, here we go. Frontier Town, Water Wheel, Water Tower, Lumber Yard. Some interesting old stores and even a village blacksmith. And what frontier town would there be without a saloon, dance hall girls, card players, and well, yeah. take a look, folks, just an uh, interesting clientele. Even when we're around the corner here, the old barn, <laughs> well, that's where all the skeletons hang out after, their, after work, and 
Bud. My little horse there, he loves to watch the train go by. Oh, some more interesting characters from Old Town here, but don't know where Gene Simmons from Kiss came from, folks. Another glimpse up there of Old Town. Whiskey Creek Hotel, that's the back part of the haunted house I was telling you about. Oh, and I do apologize, Bart still hasn't closed that outhouse door. Well, to a right, the entrance into Old Town, the Grand Mains, the left. Wedding Zoo, playground, I assume that they've already put the... Nazi castles down for the evening. And as we get a little closer into the train station, just a reminder, arms, legs, nose, toes, everything inside the carriage until I come to a complete stop, give you the okay to disembark. So on behalf of the Gailies, thank you very much for joining us on the farm today and pumpkin fest. And we hope you have a very Happy Thanksgiving.